The fall at Carib Castle. A large battle had begun at Carib Castle. The conversation led by Devlin and the Cardinal officers of Angelo, Sane and Zanfan, braced themselves as they attacked. All of the remaining leaders of Carib were at the front fighting of fighting the resistance. Quan and the other minor knights were facing them. Word had finally gotten out. Vanildos was killed and Adevon had killed himself. The whereabouts of Savannah and Joker Black were unknown to King Leclerc. Only he and his faithful ace knight, Colos, was in the throne room along with some elite guards. Leclerc, panicking. My daughter is missing. My top scientist is dead. And an enemy is outside out of nowhere. This reminds me of our defeat by the Builderon as they march on us back in Utopia all those years ago. Carlos, if I was another time, timeline ago, my lord. Leclerc, whatever, where is my queen? Carlos, don't worry, sir. I put her safely away. Smiles. Leclerc, good, I can always count on you, my loyal and faithful ace knight. As these two kings talked, Angelo and his team landed their ship on the roof of the castle. Ben Angelo, Lerner, Dill, Thurston and Sophia went inside the castle to meet up with the king. As they worked down from the roof and lobby, they marveled at the majesty of the castle. It had majestic grey tiles on the walls, sapphire chandeliers and marble glass floors. Angelo, it's kind of old fashioned, but I could dig it. This castle will be mine soon. Let's go. Back to the fight outside, Sanfan and Zane were fighting Quan. Devlin had already slain the other officers as he was a wild man on the battlefield. Quan, you two, where do I know you? Where do I know you from? Wait, and those forces. That means that woman. Ah, Zane, woman must be Sophia. Sanfan, ah, yeah. They must be still alive. I'm confident that they will find our Lord. Saying, yeah, let's finish this guy off and welcome our Lord to his new castle. Soon they managed to slay Quan together, which wasn't easy. While the fighting was going on outside, the team inside was making their way to the front room. Leclerc, go my elite guards, kill the intruders. The guards moved out. But Lerner and Dill made quick work of them. Ben Thurston and Sophia walked their lord to the room where the king was. Leclerc. Damn, it's Angelo. Angelo. Ah, it's the king. I'm here to continue our little chats we had earlier. Leclerc. What the hell are you talking about? What talk I had with you, you incompetent ass? Colos walks behind Leclerc and draws out his sword. Leclerc. Colos. You must. Ugh. He stabbed. Sophia and Thurston. What? Colo smiles as he puts the sword through Leclerc's. Nice and slowly. Angelo unfazed. Like I said, I came here to continue my chat with the king. Meanwhile, Jay had done his part and overworked Susanna and Joker to death. Now was now he was hurrying to the Carib Castle, as the battle had already begun. Back at the castle, first thing. But why, Sophia? But where's the queen? Have you killed her too, Carlos? Yes, I put her safely away. Leclerc, the end of me is by this bastard. Falls down dead as Carlos takes out his sword out of him. Angelo clapping. Well done, Carlos. I couldn't have done it better. Sophia, speechless. Carlos, yes, Angelo. Now all of the old God of Carib are gone. The new age can now begin. I thank you for your pep talk you give me. Angelo, welcome. But you and I can't rule this universe together. Nor I go and serve you. Carlos, 
I know this will happen. I trained my whole life to face your army of law. Come at me. Angelo, he is at his full power now. I don't want you lot to go easy on him. No, 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 Dill, first thing. And the last of the ace knights, all three. Yes, sir. Sophia, I'll protect you, my lord. First thing and the rest of, of you, do well. Colos, <laughs> let's finish it. Rushes them. The bow then began as Ace Knight used his sword play against the three opponents. It had been a long time since Leonard Dell had faced a strong opponent. The first thing this was the strongest foe ever. Colos had mastered all of the other Ace Knight's moves and plus his own had made him the strongest in the universe. Dell and Leonard held Colos back while first then fired rounds at him. Colos used protective armor on to block the bullets. So first then had to go all in. Swords, lasers, swords, boomerangs, iron heart, king's blade. The mass of the four ace knights was now in one night. No, no, his strength is incredible. Dill, damn right. First thing, focus guys, our lord is watching. So the fear of them rushed colors all at once and each joined their blades in one together to broke through the armor. Colos falling, bastards. I was careless. Sophia happily, they did it. Colos on the floor, sorry, my fan. I blew it, dies. Dill, confused. Is what? Angelo, it matters not. This universe is now mine. Funny, I was giving, I was saving that line for Bakun. <laughs> First thing, speechless. Sometime later, in the throne room, Angelo sat on the throne. Sophia and first thing stood by his left and right, standing in the front of Fair Lord on different sides of the royal carpet, while San Fran on the right and Zane on the left. Behind them were Lerner and the right was still to the left. Lastly, Devlin to the right, behind Lerner and now Royal Doctor Etta behind him Dell on the left Angelo this scene reminds me of when my ancestor finally took the universe with his small but powerful group now I follow behind him Sanfan congratulations my lord the universe is now yours Angelo gets up no I'm not satisfied just yet I must surpass my ancestor no surpass it with a flawed leader that's ever lived as leader of uh, Angelo as leader of Angelo Cardino I shall overcome. We must make ready to make to take the Pankron universe next. Only then will I truly be satisfied. So therefore, men, women of Anjosa Cartagena, let me hear you roar. All roar. Roar! If Angelo having a universe of his own, his ambitions were now at a new level. The destined rematch between Angelo and Baha Baha was just beyond the horizon.